National Sorry Day is the time for us all to come together to share the steps in healing for the Indigenous Australians who were taken away from their families and communities in the Stolen Generation. The Stolen Generation saw children and people removed from their families and communities. The Bringing the Home report was tabled in the National Parliament on the 26th of May in 1997. It was the result of a national inquiry. It was a pivotal moment for Australians to recognise that the stolen generation had seen enormous suffering and grief and injustice for Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people across our nation. It is very important that we as Australians now join to ensure that we can help Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people heal. A year later, National Sorry Day was started and it's in very important time for all of us, particularly of those of us who work in health, to come together to make sure that our government has appropriate strategies to improve the health, well-being and outcomes for all Aboriginal people in our region. We have to commit to closing the gap the gap in life expectancy for Aboriginal people in our region. And then also starting on the 27th of May, we start National Reconciliation Week. And this year the theme is all in it together. And you would have guessed with all of the restrictions and the upheaval and the disruption from COVID-19, it's a really great opportunity for us to join with Aboriginal people across our region around reconciliation so join me, let's think about how we can recognise the injustice caused to Aboriginal people through National Sorry Day, and then joining with Aboriginal people in National Reconciliation Week in coming together. We're all in this together.